How's it going everyone, Man Sparty here, bringing you another video in the Software Inc. series. So now, today we're going to continue almost where we left off uh, with the last episode. And i am now finished the alpha phase of alpha 2. And I'm going to start beta today. Um, so let's get these people actually arriving for work. And there we go. Okay, so I actually remember to bring in cleaning staff, which I forgot to do last night. Uh, okay. So now I'm still seeing with 300,000 in the bank, so I'm pretty confident that we ought to get this finished in time. And I set the release date as April 1984. So I've got about four more months to finish this. So it should happen. Now, one thing I actually discovered, I didn't realize you could actually do this until today, was you can, by going down to manage teams, you can set the time that people arrive. So what I've seen is that I lose a lot of my marketing during the evenings um, with hype. So what I've done is I've hired another marketeer, made another marketing team with them, but I've set their arrival time to 28 hours and they work until 8 o'clock in the next morning. So they're working, same thing, they're working 8 hours, but they're working the night cycle instead. So now I'm going to lose a lot less people and my marketing can then be a lot more effective because it's then running 24 hours. And you can see now he rocks up and works the same desk um, because I set the one on the left to just my programmer, my Agony Mouse, Anthony Mouse, whatever his name is. And then I set the other one to open. So now I see, why is he not doing anything though? Yeah, he's got a raise, so I'm just work. All tasks are finished. Oh, for some reason I forgot to set marketing to onto actual marketing. Okay, he'll carry on working now. Um, I did release the second version. So, apparently still no one knows. I don't know how the, your target demographic is supposed to know who you are. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Because I'm constantly marketing. I got to the stage where they say, please stop harassing us with marketing. And yet it'll still say no one really knows who I am. So I really have no idea how to get that going. Um, but yeah, it might be the next big hit. But it's not that feature rich. It's not that far from release. As I said, I've only got four months to finish this. So hopefully I do get it actually finished in time. Only thing with having people working 24-7 is you can't actually skip ahead because people are there pretty much all the time. But as you can see, I've got a lot more followers this time. I'm sitting with over 87,000 already. So I'm quite happy with that. Um, I've got 6,800 fans after creating the first version, which is awesome. So fans will generally uh, continue to buy your software and continue continue to support you. So you do want to have as many fans as possible. Um, so yeah, it's coming along quite nicely. I've got a lot of followers this one. Hopefully this one will be the next big hit that I've been waiting for. Uh, like I said, I've still got 300k in the bank, so I've got more than enough time to actually do what needs to be done. I've finished this set of marketing, and... See, Mount keeps annoying us about Alpha 2, but Mount Spider is not well known in the market, which is quite irritating. Uh, they've really started work on Alpha 2, and it doesn't look very feature-rich. The press release has some cool videos in it, and it sounds great. It is stated to release in April 1984. So I'm just going to continue market and just do another, just I'm going to do, just do text because I won't finish the picture and video one in time. And I'm going to release another press build to just try and amp up the followers even more. Um, so I'm really trying, oh, I keep forgetting to select mark two. Um, so yeah, hopefully this one will be a lot, more be uh, a lot better because I'm really, really pushing the marketing with the one like I'm spamming it um, to a whole other level. And again, yeah, it's those guys again. Still apparently not who's around me, even though I keep bugging them, but yeah, it's looking great. I'm sitting with almost 100, 130,000 followers now, so follower-wise, it's looking very good. I'm in February, so I've just got this month and next month to finish it, and to get rid of as many bugs as possible. Uh, I did finish the alpha code on point. I think I needed 7.6 and I got 7.7, .7, so I'm happy with the alpha code. Um, the bed is going well already. 73 bugs fixed. I spent the last, what, three months working on just getting rid of the bugs. So it should be a very clean cut, good looking program. Um, again, keeping that marketing going 24 seven, now I'm losing a lot less followers because generally I find I lose about 20% of my followers per month over the night cycle. Sorry. And by constantly having people working on hype, I'm then not losing as many people, as many followers. Okay, cool. So I'm just going to keep it just on hype at the moment because it's, there won't be enough time to finish a marketing um, campaign. Sorry, I couldn't think of the word. A marketing campaign this month. And okay, so I'm dead on point for getting released at the right time. So let's do it. And hopefully I'll get back quite a bit. So I'm sitting at 286. 
Um, so let's release this. Yes, I want to release this. Most certainly want to market this thing. I'm going to set the marketing budget at 100,000. Because I really need this Alpha 2 to kick off quite well. And the teams will be Mark 1 and Mark 2. And let's get this going. So I had 130,000. So I'm going to try and order 100,000 uh, copies. See how it goes. It's going to cost me 20 grand, but that's okay. Uh, units, tens, hundreds, thousand. Units, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands. So it's ten thousand. That should work. So let's bring them in, and hopefully this pays off. I'm going to cancel my support for Alpha One because I've now got Alpha Two out already. Well, it's going to be out in a second, and that's not bad. Um, I didn't actually meet demand. I didn't make enough copies. Um, seems off two order copies. So end up selling eight thousand. I could have order, sworn I ordered ten thousand or hundred thousand. Anyway, I ordered another ten thousand. Actually, ran out of copies there, which was the problem. Um, I'm actually, gonna order fifty thousand. Not hundred percent sure how that happened. Um, yeah, I wonder if I can actually buy servers already. Or if it's too early. I can actually get a server. Um, servers allow you to do digital distribution, uh, which then boosts your sales a little bit. I think that might be worthwhile. Um, yeah, I think that'll be worthwhile. So let me get one set up quickly. At least that way I can then do. Um, sorry, I can then do. Uh, Digital dis distribution, which will make my life a little bit easier. I need to put some pictures up to make this person happy because it's now a rather bland office space. Okay, now distribution. Open digital distribution platform. Yes, I want to distribute my own stuff, and I'll use server zero because I only have one server. Let's see what everyone said about our software. Very complex piece of craftsmanship, but it runs very smooth. It'll be interesting to see how it can compare to Finance 11 by Flash Trap. It's lacking features. It's a nice, well-priced uh, product, which is good to hear. Um, hopefully, I do end up making more money now that I've ordered more copies. Uh, I spent 100k buying more copies. Um, so yeah, let's see how it goes. Marketing is sparse. So hopefully, it actually ends up picking up because it's quite irritating having sparse marketing for some reason, even though I spent a lot of time and effort marketing it. But it really, it seems like it's doing better. And my servers actually can't even deal with the server load. I need another server. Um, do I have space for another server? Yeah, I should have space on the server. And again, I didn't meet sales. I got 40,000. What does it mean it like, doesn't meet demand? Okay, let's keep this 40,000 in stock. That should be okay. I'm going to bring in another server though, because my server is currently dying. Uh, server. Okay, how servers work is, so now I have, um, uh, the, the load is too much, so I'll select my fallback as being server 1, server 1's fallback will be server 0, so they'll like loop into each other and they'll cover each other. Um, yeah, so next month it should be okay, and I'll be able to actually do the digital distribution much easier. I don't know why I didn't pick up immediately. Okay, it should, it should go along okay now. Um, so yeah, this has been quite successful. I'm almost at my million mark. Hopefully Alpha 2 will actually get me to that 1 million. Um, looking at the place, it's quite filthy. They call in everyone to clean it up. So that's not bad. I've gone from 6,000 followers to 17,000 followers. So people are liking my software, which is great to hear. And yeah, I'm still not sure how I don't have enough distribution. And hit the million mark. That's awesome. Okay, so let's close that up. Let's see, Alpha 2, I've got, so I've got more than enough copies in, and my d digital distribution is, it's working. Um, 1.5 peeps in my sales are digital, which is not bad, because this is 1984, that's pretty respectable for the internet. So yeah, crack the 1 million mark. Um, that's always good to see. In terms of marketing, my marketing is prominent, uh, which is fantastic to see. Um, 
So yeah, that's not looking bad at all. Can I see details from here? Quality is great. Actually uses 24,000. 2,000 refunds, which is a bit irritating. Um, but yeah, that's not bad at all. My reputation has gone up quite a bit because of it, which is nice. I got all those followers. So yeah, so Alpha 2 definitely worked. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, continue uh, working on Alpha with my primary guy. And then when I bring in the uh, additional software, which I asked everyone for in the comments in the comments in the previous video, I'm going to make a new team uh, off screen after this video to then incorporate that. And again, my servers can't deal. How? I don't know why it doesn't. So what happened? It, it should fall back onto server zero. Yeah, I'm not sure what's happening there. Um, because unfortunately you can't select. Um, where do I do it now? Digital distribution. Uh, no service. Okay, no, never mind. Um, no, the problem is that for some reason it's not. Um, the overload for server one is not going to server zero. I'm not 100 sure how to fix that. Connect server. Connect to servers. Uh, that doesn't seem to work. Which one is server zero? I think this is server zero. Yeah, because this is the overloaded one. So hopefully that works for the next one. I don't know why it's not um, uh, falling back. Because the fallback from server one should go to server zero. So unless I'm missing something. But anyway, um, apparently everyone's on vacation today. So yeah, I think in the meantime, ooh, I've actually got a lot more people. So I need to bring in more people. So for now, I guess they can help me out with. Um, walls first. So for now they can help me out with the support systems for the uh, for the product I have already. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to expand quite a bit bigger this time because I want the space to have uh, stairs. So that I'm going to be able to uh, expand later on up rather than carrying going across. Where are the doors? No, they're not here. Some nice double glass doors which look nice for looking out from the parking lot. Let's get stairs before I forget to include them later on. Put them in the corner. <laughs> Alright, I need a second story for that. Because I keep forgetting to always put the stairs in. Um, and then when it comes to later on, I have an issue. So I'm just going to do that now. I know it's cost me quite a bit up front for nothing. But <laughs> I promise you I'll end up forgetting it. And then I'm screwed later on. So I'm going to put the stairs in at the moment. There we go. Okay, so let's make, I think if I should divide this room up a bit more and have like a general room and then an actual work room. So I think I'm going to do this general room over there. So I'll have like tea and coffee and everything there. Uh, and then this will be the main space for people to actually work. So looking at office space. I'm going to try and make this one look a little bit better, just so people can start being happy with their lives rather than complaining the whole time. Um, I just realized now they're not going to get through here. Yeah, no, I'm going to need to change that wall. Get rid of this. Let's do that. A bit less space for the chill room, but they don't need much more space for the chill room. So now putting in cubicle walls. Cubicle walls just help um, reduce the amount of noise uh, that are coming to your people. And the less noise that's happening, uh, the more they can chill. Uh, well, the, the more effectively they work. Because unfortunately, the more noise in the environment, the less happy they are, and then they end up just not doing any work. Let's get the heater in, let's get a fan in. Uh, actually, let's get aircon, so it's temp. Because this is a room I want to actually pay off in the long run. So I'll make it quite snazzy. They will all need... Oh wait, I need computers first. 
Um, yeah, so this is going to be a pretty cool room for these guys. This is definitely all going to be programming. There's not enough light in here. I need windows. Nice big windows on either side. There should be enough light. Yes, there's actually no complaints with this room. Let's go back to office to come back and look nice with the plants and all. Like I said, little things all add up. Uh, I know it's, as I said before, it's all very silly and all. But why can't I put up against this wall? Oh, okay. Oh, I think I have a window there. Uh, wait, no. Yeah, I have a window there, that's why. Okay, so that must not go away. Uh, no, not the wall, the window. Delete. There we go. Uh, duplicate you. No, 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 no. Duplicate, there we go. Awesome. Okay, that's looking much better. Um, yes, yeah, so that looks pretty good. I'm missing I need a bookcase still. Bookcase, 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 bookcase. And there we go. So there's food and drinks in here. I'm going to actually put some food and drinks in this room. Like I said, I wanted a bit of more of a chill space. So I'm going to say... What is utility, actually? Oh, of course. Um, outdoors, office, meeting, kitchen. Uh, common room, yeah. So let's put some couches in for these people. And I will put a fridge in there. Actually, no, I'm going to put a table with some coffee. Because you know how programmers like their coffee. Oh yes, I need a clock in this room. Coffee, coffee, coffee. We have nice ones, don't complain about it later on. And kitchen. Get them a fridge and a stove. Some people can actually start making their own food here. I think I might have just blocked off the stairs. You know what, I'm actually going to see if I can expand slightly. Uh, wait, this one. Just so I can then get the stairs over there rather. Uh, remove this section. Remove this. Ah, oh, crap. Well, I need to make the next story. There we go. Got done one, and we should be good to go now. Let's move this over there. There we go. Uh, what's wrong with this? Something is blocking its path. What's blocking its path? Oh, right. The wall upstairs. There we go. What? What is blocking its path? I have no idea what's blocking this thing's path. Oh, right. Um, when I'm going upstairs, I'm going upstairs to like nowhere. So I need to see which other stairs I can actually use that'll work here. Um, I think these ones? I think these will work. Let's get rid of this quickly. Did it? Yes. That'll work. That was pretty, but that's fine. Anyway, getting back to the kitchen. Uh, stove, everything. Okay, that's not looking nice. People have now got a place to chill, and they should be quite a bit happier now. Uh, service cannot deal with distribution, that's okay. So now it comes to, I need to get a lot more staff in. So I want to look for programmers more than designers. I want to have three good programmers and one good designer. So actually, we start with one good designer. Uh, personality, system design. Bump it up to 3 2. Begin looking. Let's see. Skill wise, 43. Pretty average person. Yeah, that's right. Team, I want to make a new team. And these are going to be. Um, I'm trying to get a name for them. Slackers. Because that's not what, exactly not what they're going to be. Okay, so let's hire him for slackers. Um, and now I need to give myself three programmers. 2400. I want two system and one algorithm, I think. Let's go skill wise. You're compatible to slackers. 
you're normal and you're great, so that'll be okay. And then I just need one algorithm person. Programmer. Ah, oh, crap, I've got us. Hi, employees. Programmer. Algorithm. And good, 26. Nice young age. I think I put turn call by mistake though. Yeah. Okay, change teams to suckers. Okay, great. Um, so now I just need to change these computers to the new people. Just so that they definitely come here then. I uh, don't know their names, so let's bring the names up quickly. Because I want them just because if you have too many people from too many different teams working in one room, they don't end up getting along. Uh, put it somewhere I can see it. So that goes at the bottom four. Okay. So it's sound furniture to Carmen to Mason Dillon to Kiri Moron Moron Moran, sorry. And then to Francis Stewart. There we go. Okay, so now they'll just work there. And what I want to do is... I'm going to actually leave my main guys doing as support for Alpha 2 at the moment. And I'm going to start working on Alpha 3. So make a sequel. Let's see now. Make another one. I'm going to have 11%. So I really do need to go all out with this one. Depends on the GUR, please click feature first, GUR, please click feature first. So visualization tools I don't really need. Um, I guess I do actually need it. So let's go all out with this one. Um, I know people aren't really great at art, I must do them an art training course before it actually starts. The, teams are, the team is just going to be slackers for now. And let's. Oh, I need a 2D editor. Unfortunately, I'm going to use someone else's 2D editor, so I'm going to choose the one that has the highest. Oh, sorry, not highest profit. Highest active users, because it's the one that's most likely going to be used. And let's do it. So, Slackers are going to start working on it. I do want to just work on my Slackers and get them all to do some art training first. Educate you all in art. And I just need 2D art. I think it's a 2D art. Um, I'm gonna make it a very extensive course because I've, I've broken it now. I've got quite a bit of money, and yeah. So the next video is gonna start off with me working on the new type of software that you all suggested. I might just build the upstairs of this room to work on that, while these guys work on CMS. And my guy pretty much just does um, slave work for the moment, just because he works a lot faster than the people. So I find him actually getting through. The support much quicker than normal and then hopefully my slackers once they get back from work you can see them start to work on alpha 3 and see if they can crack two maybe three million so yeah thanks for watching please do like and subscribe as always it really does help me out and let's see how this company goes from here we've grown quite nicely we've hit the one million mark which is awesome it's always fun hitting the one million mark that really it's really the first big milestone for the company in software inc and it's really great hitting because they know your software is really kicking off well and people are enjoying it. I've got 20,000 followers now, so people are enjoying what I'm doing. Um, I sold quite a lot of copies. My marketing is prom prominent. Everything's looking good. It's looking up now for Mountain Spider Software Development Incorporated. That actually sounds a lot better than just Mountain Spider. But anyway, so thanks for watching, guys. I hope you did enjoy this video and I hope it helped, especially learning how to manage your teams and set what times they come in. So again, under HR, manage teams. And then you can select the timing there. Don't forget that. I've seen helped that I've found that it really does help out. So thanks for watching everyone and cheers. Enjoy.